Oh my God, I've had some fucking issues tonight, ladies and gentlemen, but uh, ah, here I am. Uh, once again, uh, for my final attempt of the evening, <laughs> uh, I guess I don't know what the fuck it is. I had way too many videos blogging up my fucking Logitech fucking file, so I keep getting fucking cut off. Anyways, oh, well, let me see that like this. Um, you know, uh, kind of getting, kind of getting straight to the point this evening, because I have any fear of the fact that I will not have enough time to do this. You know, I want to uh, quickly address a uh, few, few people and a few things. You know, first of all, Douglas uh, or Doug C. Yeah. You know, uh, I, uh, I really appreciated the video uh, commentary, and uh, I really, really, you know what? I, I'm totally down with everything you said. And I understand it. And on some level, I can even appreciate it. Um, but can you appreciate, Doug, that uh, I have a brother who has uh, served very, very proudly, uh, both as a flight paramedic and a, a military, a military uh, medical uh, a flight tactician. Um, can you appreciate the fact that you know what? There are so many people that could have been so much more deserving of those of those rewards of those merits, other than that young man. Uh, I mean, a uh, custom fucking bicycle uh, that may have indeed uh, cost uh, uh, fucking about uh, you know ten thousand fucking dollars or twenty thousand dollars. Oh wow, I just said it. Thank you. Uh, you know, basically, uh, you know, a whole bunch of things I could say. To spite this young, smite this man, uh, young man further, uh, this handicapped person, I could say a whole bunch of things to really, you know, blast this fucking dude and say, hey, but you want to know something? You know what's great, Doug? I have a feeling now that this gentleman, thanks to Don Shipley, goes to bed every night crying his motherfucking ass to sleep because he knows what he did was wrong. He knows what he did was unwarranted and unmerited to him, which means. All the fucking little freebies he got, like the hotel rooms and the meals and the first class this and the first class that, and all the little custom bicycles and his little fucking uh, Navy SEAL fucking t-shirts, uh, uh, you know, and all stuff. You know what? He knows he was never deserving of any of that shit. That's my point simply. Okay? Um, again, you also want to say facade. Huh? Facade. What facade am I living under, Doug? What, I'm being truthful? Is that really what hurts here, Doug? Huh? Tell me. I'm going to get the French for knowing me. You tell me. I'll, I'll listen to you for a second. Hold on. Sorry, Doug. You're kind of wrong on that one. Um, I know what you're saying. I'm not listening. I don't, uh, I don't buy it, Doug. You know? I don't buy it. Same thing. The bottom line is, is that, you know what, Doug? What he did was pretty fucking snaky, was pretty sleazy, and uh, yeah, I got no, I got no mercy for cats like that. I got no apathy. I actually don't have empathy for a lot, or apathy, for or empathy, apathy, empathy, both. <laughs> there is two. I don't have either for any types of those types of people at all, um, because they have no understanding. I mean, uh, from what I've actually researched, by the way, I have researched chemo, and uh, to a degree, and I understand that he was actually in, in the military. Uh, the fucking guy was in the Navy Corps, and he was a fucking Marine, if I'm not mistaken. So, you know, what's with the G.I. Joe bit? You know what I mean? What's with the fucking ninja bullshit? What's, what's with the fucking, I'm claiming to be, I know he never claimed to be a, a G, uh, G.I. Joe or uh, Ninja. So I'm just saying, though, right? What's the deal, you know, with having to run around and say, I was a Navy SEAL? You know, I'm sorry. You know, you go around saying bullshit like that. That's like saying, you know what? Because may, may at one time or not, I've been hanging around a group of individuals and actually was part of, I was part of it. A, I'm not going to get into it, but I was part of that. A club under a club under a club, okay? You know what I mean? That was, okay? It's kind of it's kind of called the chain of command, okay? It's, you know what I mean? And uh, actually, uh, believe it or not, if you know know anything about that lifestyle, 
if you know what I'm referring to, is the uh, the baseball team. Okay, the baseball team. Okay, that's all I'm going to say. Uh, and they have the baseball team and the football team. All right. Uh, you know, the bottom fucking line here is that what he did was wrong. You know, and for you to keep bringing God into this, Doug. That's just fucking wrong. For you to use that book you hold so sacred to defend a man like that is wrong. And you yourself will have to seek penance for that in the afternoon. Just remember that. Uh, as for uh, Mr. Fucking Yesterday and uh, Mr. Hiddens, I don't know what you're all up to really. Doesn't even, you guys don't phase me. You know what I'm saying? I'm just going to keep riding on you, you know. And uh, I'm actually, you know, wanting to fucking check out the uh, the new uh, disco ball tonight. You know what I mean? We're going to get that fucking rolling in a little while. So I'm going to actually have to touch this all fucking loose here. Um, yeah, by the way, uh, I, I, I hide behind such a facade, Doug. You know what I mean? I have a 20-bedroom mansion and a fucking Lamborghini. That would be hiding behind a facade. You better get your fucking facts straight, Jack. <laughs>